Hey, thank you, buddy. Alright. Boot, you're an idiot, by the way. I'm pretty sure I blocked you. Don't eat too much fringe. Alright, so I'm gonna play... What remains of either stitch? Game is... I don't know. It, it was suggested before I, I went MIA for two months. We'll see how it is. And then after, I guess we'll play House Party for a little bit longer. And then after about three hours, we'll I'll have about two hours to kill. Then we can ask chat for games. But until then, fuck off. And don't suggest shit. It won't be played. Only, right, let's go. It's only a game. Why do you have to be mad? Wow. Tyler, are you telling me I can get free reformed bottle if I buy one of your amazing... Hi... Look, I just only, skipped it. It's only a game. Okay. Why do you have to be mad? You don't need a <laughs> HDMI splitter. Hold on, wait. PlayStation away. made it an option you can change in settings. That guy doesn't know shit. Don't listen to him. Dude, guys. Okay, thank that you for telling, it, telling him to fuck off and he's wrong. But listen, I'll get them all after... I will... I'll understand how to run it. I'm not stupid. I can set that shit up. It's fine. Well, you tell me I can get a free before I buy one amazing high quality delicious pre-workout supplement. But I have to use the code Bird Blooders for the deal. Thank you. See, yeah, that's what I mean, dude. For limited time though. The bundle's not gonna last forever. Get it while it's hot. It's only game. Why do you have to be mad? All right, let's go. Hopefully, this doesn't suck dick. It should be interesting. I have watched a little bit of it, a little bit, but I didn't want to spoil it. I think Lyric played it, but when Lyric, eh, yeah, never mind. I'm only, not. Nah, it's never only mind. game. Arrow! Why Wait, Greek. Oh. Love you, Beta. I hope you go really far, and I hope you stay there. Uh, yo, so far, hey, top notch so far. I'm, I'm really, really excited for uh, this game right now, guys. Seriously, that right there, when I fucking load a game, that's the first thing I want to hear to make me continue playing. Nice, devs. Already smacked that right in the mouth. Good shit, devs. Nice, guys. Awesome. Guy Good shit. The fuck all around the board. These people wonder why, why they sell no copy. I'm stuttering a lot today. It's a lot. Alright guys, I'm turning D's and subs off. I will read every single one of them after. In probably about 20 minutes, I'll just speed run all of them. I promise. I promise. Pause Pies Maho. Thank you guys, Travi. Thank you. Kind of... Let's see, we'll see how it goes, but I'm... Is that good? We're all right there. Kind of seems like a VR game. Uh, yikes. Alright, if this game is dog shit, I'm probably... Well, I can't really skip it. So, yeah. I'm gonna force myself through all two hours, boys. Get ready. I don't know. Surely it'll tell the story when it goes on. Let us wait here. Alright. So it is. Hopefully it's not too shit. Mm. Only if it's like one, like if it's a line. If I can move. It shows like some kind of like storyline, so you can see it at the beginning. Get immersed. We'll open it then, girl. Hey, how the fuck do you? A lot of this isn't going to make sense to you. Oh, one and of I'm these sorry things. About that. I'm just going to start at the beginning with the house. Give it a chance. Give it a chance. Sprint. I lived here until I was 11. 
but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Ooh. Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago, marked urgent, open immediately. I hadn't been back since my brother Lewis's funeral. Ooh, this is gonna be rough. In yeah, room, this is gonna be a rough my one. My mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. Maybe she thought I'd know, or she thought the mystery would be enough to bring me back. Ooh, this is gonna be rough. I can do it. Fine. Push through. Yeah. No one had driven this way in a long time, but I saw a few have prints. The truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. But now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. Can I sprint at least? No, I have to the walk the entire exactly way. Like I remembered it, the way I'd been dreaming about it. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. Now, as a 17-year-old, right, I go. knew the exactly house. This is... those words were. Well, we'll see what happens I in was here. afraid this of the house. It. I don't have my, my uh I hope the key might unlock the high. front door. It didn't. Looking in... I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. Mm. Guys, this might be too hard, like, to push through. I have to climb these leaves. Wait, I'm a girl. Ooh, I got titties. Wait, I'm pregnant! No, see, now we're getting some, some plot in this. Okay, that makes me like it a little bit more. Don't just toss me into the fucking game in some random world. Prowling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. I, I might have to do, like, game reviews. For the first time in years... I felt like I was home. Nothing in the house looked abnormal. There was just too much of it. Like a smile with too many teeth. Few few bad bad things right now. Okay, what am I doing? Why am I why am I in the house? Why'd I spot in the woods? Why is there no beginning story? I I don't have an objective right now. Yes. The Take table fucking note. Still a wreck from I the can make you a lot of money. I gotta climb through here. Look. Where I came from? Yeah. There's a window upstairs, maybe. There's got to be a spring. Reticle? Ret reticle? Do you get a gun? Getting a weapon might spice us up a little bit. After Milton disappeared, Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes.
So she had a brother. My grandpa Sam spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother, Calvin. Got a peephole too? Yes, it do. As a kid, I just assumed every house had peepholes and sealed rooms you weren't allowed inside of. Okay, so she was locked up. Okay, getting a little bit more plot in here. The last time I was in Edith Senior's room, I was 10 and she was painting my portrait. Okay, so a girl? Was this a foster home? Okay, so this was... Listen, you got it. It's okay, Big T. It's okay, Big T. Foster child. She lived with all her, her family. You know those houses? How some people have like, their grandparents live upstairs, they live downstairs. I guess that's what happened here. Right? Not bad. Not bad. Starting to understand. I can't push shit. Hmm. Molly always seemed like a girl I could imagine being friends with. If she hadn't died in 1947. Ghost. Okay. What year is it? I spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Okay, so it was. Oh! It's like a heritage house? Or whatever it's called? So the house was passed down from family to family, right? Maybe? That's why... It and when somebody Please dies, they seal up the passages, room. But I never believed him. Maybe? I'm thinking, trying too hard. Turns out, my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. Alpha? Okay. Reading this, maybe it sounds like I had a plan. Wait, she, oh, had she's no reading something right now. Door. Oh, the book she opened on the water! So this is a memory, right? So what the fuck? Just like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. December 13th, 1947. Dear Diary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's going to happen. It started when Mom sent me to bed without dinner. I woke up and I was starving. Wait, now I'm in a... So I looked around for something to eat. I'm reading a story, and in the story, I'm reading a story. I kept eating and eating... Wait, what? Whoa. Wait, what? I ate a lot of things that night. Wait. Devs, you got this shit all fucked up, dude. The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Am I playing? Mom, can I come out now? Sweetheart, it's late. Go to sleep. Doggy door? Climb out the window, maybe? Then I heard chirping outside my window. I knew it. It was a barn swallow going back to her nest. I reached out for her. She's chained in. And suddenly, I was a cat. Devs, what are you doing, dude? Can I jump? I can. Hey. I tried to be quiet, but the bird was really scared.
Uh, maybe I can go across this branch? Maybe I can go the ledge. Mom and Dad didn't even look at me. Wait, those... What? Are they AFK? Yo! Dad! Mom! Guys! Hello? Well, might be because you're a fucking cat. Huh? Is this the right way? And, and, and to be quite honest... At least she has parents to to even uh, ignore her, you know? Don't be selfish. Some some of us don't even have parents that would that we'd love to have ignore us. Uh over here? That's a long ass jump. I jumped and I almost got her. Run, bitch. Gotta get up here, probably. I could tell she was getting really tired. She's not even flying, though. Now I was up in the big tree. I promised Dad I wouldn't climb it anymore. Oh, so she... All I cared about was eating that mama bird. Anymore. So this has happened before. I gobbled her up. Uh... And suddenly, I was an owl. First, all I heard was the wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. Hey, so I guess I look in the grass now? Devs, you gotta get some... Give us a plot to follow. Give us some guidance, dude. What am I doing? Rabbits. Oh, I gotta press space bar. That's a pretty fucking good owl noise, isn't it? Ah, here! Ah, yeah! Come here. I imagined his face looking up and seeing mine through my talons. I swallowed him up. And I didn't chew one bit. Then I flew off to find something big. What am I going to turn into now? A mama rabbit. Another rabbit. Wait, it's bugged. It's not even moving. Dad, are you fucking kidding? Hey! Top 15 H1 Zoom player for a reason. I started choking, but I couldn't stop eating. And suddenly, I was a shark. Can I move? Yeah, I, I can move. Dude, what the fuck am I playing? I rolled off the cliff and into the ocean. Now, I was hungrier than ever. Okay, so now I'm a shark in a climate that doesn't belong. I, dude, I took a class in high school and I learned all about this shit. Watch this movie called like The Big Ocean or The Big Blue or something. I know some shit about wildlife, is what I'm saying. I can hold space. Yeah, there you are. No, no, no. Don't run. Don't run, girl. The seal! A sea lion or a seal? I wanted that juicy seal. Seal, I knew it. See, you see what I mean? Big ass brain, boy. Come here. Could it give me a bit of assistance? Like a aim assist or something? The fuck is this? <laughs> Wait, really? Dude, 
I swear to God, these controls are not easy. I promise. But it's actually extremely hard. She's still floating, so I gotta chase her and I gotta kill an, an injured animal. Right? Did she sink? She would float, I'm pretty sure, so she'd be near the surface, right? I think fat floats, so that she should be around the surface. Miss it? Like, oh, there she is. I can smell your blood. Look at her. Oh, she's trying to run. Ooh, I bet I'm not supposed to make noise or something, maybe. Or it probably doesn't matter, honestly. The way this game's going, it, it doesn't big, matter. But I moved real quiet. that happening, Ira? Oh. Woohoo! Going right up my butt. I got closer and closer. Wait. This is the room I was just in. I'm almost positive. All of my stomach started growling. All my stomach? She has more than one stomach? And suddenly, I was me again. I held my breath for a long time, but I couldn't hear anything. I think it's waiting for me to fall asleep. Oh, it might be under the bed. 
but it's not going to wait much longer. It needs to be, and we both know I will be delicious. I'm not sure if I believed all of that, but I'm sure Edie would have. Okay, what the fuck? I'm trying to understand the story, devs. Like, I'm, I'm really trying to give you a chance, you know? Give your game some obviously much needed publicity. But if you idiots can't put together a simple storyline that the average customer w would want to follow along, so Molly I was wasn't. Edie had spent a lot of time here before my mom sealed the doors. So Molly was a monster? And this was her diary? I'm pregnant, I swear. So the whole point of me reading that was to... Was to what? Uh, let me feel like I'm in Molly's shoes? Where'd I go? Over here, I'm pretty sure. I grew up looking at Molly's room through the peephole. Okay, so Molly was dead already before she was alive. So this isn't her house. I was right about that. Molly's gerbil had a tiny bedroom with its own even tinier gerbil cage. Aww. Well, Being inside for the first time, I felt like I'd stepped behind a painting. I can't yeah. describe it, but I felt like some part of Molly was still here. Probably a ghost, a bitch. Knowing how old this house is. So every room is a story, I'm assuming, right? And then after all the stories, you get to the final story, and it's like, maybe it's my story. This will be obvious later, but my mom never told me any of these stories. Edie would have, but mom didn't like bringing up the past. Though... When we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. Wait, I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. Okay, so let me get this. Okay, do you guys remember when she was a cat? She said, Mom and Dad don't even notice me. So, this used to be Molly's house. This used to be her parents' room. I'm Molly's... Um... Molly's daughter? Right? Grandparents. Yeah, that'd be right. Thanks. Even in her 90s, sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. I think I was right. Ooh, they were, ah, old people. They take a lot the of only medicine. trace Grandpa Sam's first wife Kay left on the house was the pink bathroom. She looks like it'd be filthy. It was a pretty big trace. Oh, here we go. Story number two. Wonder what I change into now. I'm almost positive I'm right. I'm almost positive. There's a secret in this bathroom. Oh, gotta open shit. It's in the last place you would look. It isn't in the cupboard. It's hidden in this book. Yo, you're pregnant. You think you should be doing all this? Jesus, care about the baby. Come on now. Sven gave Sam an old camera he'd refurbished. He never put it down. Oh, I can crouch? that command? I didn't learn that. From the paintings on the wall, it was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. Hey, this is the boys' room. Probably her brother. Probably Molly's brother's room. There should be a diary. I knew Grandpa Sam had a twin. 
and that he never talked about him. I guess my grandpa didn't like history any more than my mom did. This is Roger Roger. How I Want to Remember My Brother by Sam Finch. The thing I remember is that when he made up his mind, that was it. Hi, right, now I'm a kid with a broken leg. Wait a minute. I'm pretty sure the girl I'm playing now has a, a, a cast on her right arm as well. My brother said he'd die before he ate another mushroom. And he did. Whee! At Barbara's funeral, we swore he'd never be afraid again. And he wasn't. I'm controlling this, guys, also. Yeah. I think I'm swinging in a game. always wanted to fly. Jump. The jump. gonna jump. But that day, he finally made up his mind to jump off the, the... What? I told him oh. going around was impossible. Jump, Maybe bitch! Maybe if I hadn't said that. Dude, I used to do this at my grandma's. She had a swing, dude. Alvin, I'm not gonna tell you again. Maybe if the wind hadn't picked up, Then maybe he'd still be here. But I doubt it. Slow down! I think he'd already made up his mind. Was he his head? Oh, he hits his head on the... That's what I want to remember about my brother. So Calvin killed himself. Basically. Calvin Calvin's killed himself. Story felt strangely familiar. When I was Calvin younger, killed himself, I Molly do the exact same thing. Got eaten by a monster? Right? Yeah, these controls suck. After the funeral, Edie roped off Calvin's half of the room. Yep. So she did. Or so he did. It's or when the wind picked up and swung his swing eight circles around the tree. You short ass kids. I swear. <laughs> no shit he killed himself. Look how tall he was. Midget looking boy. Poor guy. I got picked on. Mom said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. Oh, I'm going over here. off with the controls. Spread those ways. Are you supposed to play this with a controller? Tell the, this, this the passages much were happier. a pretty tight fit. They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. Was somebody sipping? Edie's father, Odin, built the original house. Mm, I knew it. Probably should have. Was I supposed to go? Oh, I was. I don't think I was supposed to get out. Ah. Uh. Growing up, I always thought Whoa. of Barbara as a child. God damn! Yeah, that kind of looks... Yikes. I get into it. 
I never thought about how hard it must have been for her afterwards. Story book? Oh. Of all the stories people wrote about Barbara's death, I'm surprised Edie saved this one. Old Jack here with another ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. I'm calling it The Surprise Ending of Barbara Finch. As a child star, Barbara was famous for her scream. Now at 16, she was all washed up. A has been. <laughs> All league but in a lucky me. break, she'd been asked to perform her signature scream at a local convention for monster movie fans. It was just the boost her career needed. Unfortunately, her scream hadn't aged well. <laughs> mm, getting better. I think you just need the right motivation. Her biggest fan and current boyfriend was blind. Was about to demonstrate when. Ah! Ah! Now that was a great scream. It was Barbara's father, Sven. Oh. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother, Walter. Her convention comeback was cancelled. So she despised. <laughs> okay, I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I tried? A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orcas Island tonight. Police are urging residents to. That came from the basement. You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. Why is your basement door locked? Because my dad likes making puzzles and secret passages. There's a key hidden in the music box. The secret is to keep winding and winding until finally the key pops out. Thanks, babe. I'll be back in oh, a sec. He called, he called me babe. 20 minutes later, Rick hadn't returned. A gang of hoodlums. So Barbara spot. went to look for him. Right on cue. She reached for the music box. On turning and turning. Oh, I guess I do. I gotta do it. Oh, I do have to do it. And as she wound the key, she listened for Rick, but the house was silent. It's not gonna be. This this is looking jump scarish. Imagine the worst. Nick! The gang's leader is the infamous Hookman Killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. What? door behind you. Lay enough out last. I'm scared. Yeah, this is obvious. trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, I'm not scared, Rick. I'm furious. Then act furious. All I'm getting from you now is that you're hurt and confused and you Yeah. She threw him out. Yeah, get the fuck she out, Rick! For something to remember him by. Barb, have you seen my other crutch? I have it. And she was still holding it when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. 
Somebody comes to the TV, oh, maybe? Later. Barbara! Walter? What's going on up there? Ah! Okay, I'm coming up. His but voice acting is, is fucking on point. Dead, Walter. Oh. Yeah, the music's back, baby. Careful behind you! Don't you stab. Walter, he vanished. I can his bed sound radio. I still are. Orcas Island Police describe the man as six feet tall, with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. Behind you! I returned, saw the hook man, and smoked him. I speechless. He was quite smashing. <laughs> I want to fight. And he couldn't he was. He couldn't get enough of Barbara. Okay, Barbara. There's gotta be another way out of here. That ass, boy! She played the ass girl! She thought about abandoning Walter, but just couldn't do it. Leave him! Wait, who can't leave him? I gotta turn around and get him? Molly, <laughs> yeah, bitch, you know where that came from. Died? He wasn't moving. But she sensed this story might not be over yet. Oh, I can't jump, am I? Wait, there's a group of them, right? He's gonna be gone? Yeah, no, 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 buddy. She listened for his breathing, but all she heard was... Don't answer. This is stupid. Why would you answer the door? Someone at the door was dying to speak to you. Whatever, get in. Just do it, whatever. At the door, she heard whispering. Is coming from inside the house. I knew it. Oh dear. Now she's gonna yell. Surprise! Oh, oh guys! The monsters had come to surprise her. For Barbara, it was a dream come true. Then she saw what. Kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. She was going to be famous, and with her final breath, Barbara Finch gave the performance of her life. I wasn't there myself, but I hear Barbara was magnificent. Poor girl. She had a taste for stardom. But unfortunately, so did her fans. Of course, the police blamed it all on poor Ray, Walter. Who disappeared oh. the same night. And little Walter? Hiding under his bed the whole time. He Coward. all pretty hard. But that's another story. As for Barbara, tucked inside the music box is all they ever found of her. Her ear. Now that's what I call a real eerie tale. Okay. <laughs> 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 
Barbara was... Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered. As absurd as that comic was. Maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Uh, Barbara was killed by monster, um, a group of Halloween monsters. Correct? Was that a bra? <laughs> yep, yep, it was. I guess now I oh, know yeah. why mom didn't like me playing with the mm. music box. Oh yeah, sorry. Wait, is this the way I go? I just open the door now. Wait, I don't think, I feel like this is the wrong way. The Sasquatch motherfucker gets me every time. I don't like him there. I feel, there's no way I gotta go back through there. Right? Oh, well, I guess this is the only way. And write them? It's funny. All those times I played with the music box and never found the basement key. Basement, 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 basement. Do I have a key? Wait, right here? Mom must have locked the third floor stairs on the night we left. Um. Usually it, it gives me a, like a lead, like a way to go. There is no lead here. Do all this by myself. What? Downstairs, the front door maybe, because that's where the quest or the story ended. Or maybe. A lot of things got left behind in the whirlwind of that last night. I wonder if that comic was right about there being a key inside the music box near the basement. Oh, okay. Yo, Des. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Stream sniping, by the way. Shit, wrong way. Going downstairs. This was my dad's or the dad's puzzle room? Correct? They're like three pool tables, right? Mom said the basement. Oh, this is where he cut his hands. Unless I wanted another tetanus shot. That's where he cut his hand off or whatever? I saw Edie sneak down to the basement once, carrying packages. I thought maybe she was hiding presents. Human body parts. Or a doorway, a doorway. I knew it. It turned out she was hiding a lot more than that. Am I playing I Outlast? Asking mom once about where Walt Why isn't my gone? camera popping up? She said after Barbara died, he got as far away as he could. If there's a pattern in all these stories, I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. I was like 50 years old. Goodbye, everyone. I can't believe I've been down here for 30 years. On that first day, after the shaking started, I didn't think I'd survive a week. Oh, he's in a bunker! You're really ha having me open up again. Come on. Wait, what, what the f- Oh, I gotta move but my mouse. After a few days, I settled into a routine. That's what kept me sane. 
having a schedule, living for today. I always expect it to be dead tomorrow. It's gonna have me open about a million. If you wait long enough, you'd be used to anything. Wait, I think the date on the left changed. Pretty sure the date on Even the left changed. Even a monster chain. on the other side of the door starts to feel normal. Almost friendly. And then one day, everything just... It did change. Wow, a lot. Stop. You can tell Whatever you, you that thing the was, on his, or the, it was gone. Maybe it got tired old people of marks, waiting. I call them. Or maybe I just got tired of being afraid. It's been a week now, the longest in 30 years. I'm done waiting. Okay, Alpha, I see. I have to leave. 30 well, years? Can. 30 years might have been a little bit too long to fucking leave, but... Wait, they're called liver spots. Wait, does that mean that your liver's failing? You get spots? I know it's out there, somewhere. Whatever killed Barbara. Monsters? And Molly. Molly? And Calvin. That's why he hid. He hit the sledgehammer, picked it up, big guy. Maybe this is all a mistake. Yeah, I get that. But I need to stop living the same day. Even if it kills me. Whatever's out there, I want you to know I'm ready for it. Let's go! Hell yeah, baby! Let's go! I'm going to appreciate all of it, especially the food. I don't mind if I only have a year left. Or a month. Or a day. Or a single week. I'd be happy with one new day. I can already imagine the sun on my face. Oh, that's unlucky. <laughs> uh, <laughs> wow, that's unfortunate. <laughs> okay. Walter died when I was six. All right. Uh, I can't believe my mom never told me he was down here. That's unfortunate. <clears throat> So, uh, Walter was hit by a train. That's how Walter passed away. I'm sure my mom was trying to protect me. Wait, does this mean I'm going outside now? Our radio stacks kind of fucking with my ears. Walter blamed everybody dying on monsters. Maybe she was afraid. Maybe they were all Walter. like delusional. Maybe the family was delusional. But if she never told me about an uncle under the house, I can what only imagine what me? else she was hiding. I knew it! I don't want to make the same mistakes she made. This is fresh. The flies have been long gone, right? Trying to bury something that's still alive. Try for a train now, sweetheart. Now that there's only one of us left, or maybe two. I thought it was time I heard the stories for myself and found out what happened to everyone else. But now I'm worried the stories themselves might be the problem. Maybe we believed so much in a family curse. You did get we hit by a train. Real. Oh, wait. You didn't get hit by a train because it's all water. So, wait, does it go down? No, so, dream. Oh, I have hurt. I don't know if I should even be writing this.
Maybe it'd be better if all this just died with me. Probably. That face. Wait, what? But I thought you should know about your family. Oh, she's writing this to delete for somebody else. <gasps> she is pregnant. She's leaving it for her kid in case she dies. Or, well, no, because then the baby would die. And the history you're a part of. Go down. Maybe I don't go down. Though to be honest, I feel as lost as you probably do right now. She is writing this for somebody in the future. That is who at the beginning of the, of the when the game loads, at the beginning of the game, that's who's reading this. So she wrote it to the person that was reading it at the beginning of the game. I think the people in these stories believed them, for what that's worth. Why wouldn't you give me a sprint button, like a, a jog or something? Why does shift zoom me in? And when you look at the house, that history of imagination and stubbornness and madness, any of it seems possible. You're really gonna make me unlock the gate myself. A bike! I think we've been surrounded by death for so long, we've just gotten used you to it. You let me on it? No, of course not. You wanna know why I can't ride this bike? Because that took about another week to What kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? True. It's embarrassing for me to admit this, but... Jesus! The pet cemetery may be more uncomfortable than the human one. These are all pets? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, Three twelve, of the thirteen, thirteen forty, fifty. Mine, what the fuck? Two had been my fault. Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. Okay, so all six people. I'm sure Odin's monument had been Edie's idea. My mom was always trying to move on, but for Edie, the past never went away. She could see it poking out of the water at low tide. Edie said she dreamed about the old house every night. Maybe there was train tracks. Maybe they just got submerged. That's why the ha old house was in water. Edie's side was always easier for me to understand. That means the train tracks could have been sunk. But the older I get, the more I can see where my mom was coming from. There's more? Her dad had been pretty strict, but it wasn't enough to save her brothers. She was just trying to do better. There's more? She lost two of her brothers, just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Oh, a There's family so died. I, I could ask my mom now. Part of me thinks this is what she wanted all along. For me to come back someday and find everything out for myself. So three separate generations died, right? Maybe? Wait, is, this, is that my first save point? But looking back on it now, If she told me there was going to be so much climbing, I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. I knew it! Ha-ha! Fall, 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 fall. Point 
two weeks. So five and a half months? Wait, what if the baby is born I never prematurely? Met Sam, but I think he and my mom had a lot What if she dies with. giving birth? Then the child can read that little story that she's writing. Never met Grandpa Sam. They were both pretty intense. Sam's been shooting photos, but Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. Hunters. Country boys. Ah, yep. Yep, he is. Wait, open it. What are you doing, girl? Ooh, this boy got all the girls. Look at him, boy. Dawn, I promise, you'll never forget this weekend. Oh, shit. Yes, sir. God damn! These Give memories me a... are gonna last a lifetime. Hmm? What? Am I gonna have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Dawn. Perfect. It's gonna rain the whole weekend, isn't it? What am I doing? Never forget this weekend, Dad. Oh, I think this That's the spirit. Okay, got it. I'm gonna take some pictures, okay? Okay. Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. Good bird. You're right, Dad. It's starting Aww. to clear up. It's still freezing, though. God damn, I gotta start. I feel like there's like an uh, extra that I can get in here if I look hard enough. Definitely should not have drunk all that coffee. What are you? Uh uh, what are you doing? A picture of you. I definitely won't be moving. Hey! <laughs> That's a keeper. <laughs> oh, nothing quite like being outside. I'm just saying, I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff, if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Some guy who died. Your grandpa. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being Dad. Ooh, keep your eyes, Don. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of you. Dad, I... I... Oh, just breathe. Turn off your imagination. Let me get behind you. Do I have to do this? Don, you don't have to do anything. But if you want to survive, that. you need to be strong. Put it right over the, the left shoulder blade. Right over the left shoulder blade. Wait, I cut that perfectly. Great shot, Don. Oh, it did it for me. Okay, I was about to say. I pressed that perfectly. Oh. <laughs> Oh, don't scare me like that. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm proud of you, Don. Always remember that, okay? I don't want to shoot it. You didn't make her. Hey, did the game bug? Oh, I'm sorry, Don. Just gotta reset the timer. Wait, I'm using the camera. Wait, what? Oh, I set a camera that I gotta go walk there. One second, Don. Wait up, I'm coming. Wait, Don. Wait. Oh, wait, I'm coming. Wait, Don, wait up. I'm almost there. Ah, okay, yo. Oh, let me just get up here. Yo, what's Dad, up? Dad, it's twitching. I think That's it's... That's totally so... normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not to think about... Dad! Oh. That's un That's extremely unlucky. Wow, that's unfortunate. Of all these stories, that's the one I wish most that my that's mom unlucky. told me. Yikes. Okay. Poor guy. <sighs> what a way to go. <laughs> hey, karma, bitch. There'd be so many, like, ants and bugs and rat mice. After Sam there. died? My mom and Edie got really close. They'd both lost a lot. 
all have these weird toys too. The what? Look at that pillow. Jesus, you had this up above your baby's crib? Oh wait, I think that's in honor of them. Oh, they got a divorce? What? what? Pick it back up! Flip through? Okay, I'm putting it down then. Yikes, that command is hard. Wait, I think I might have to pick it up. I might. Oh, I can. Yeah. My mom moved up to the loft after her brothers died. <sighs> At the time, it was as far away as she could get. <sighs> Wait, did I need to go there. I can't imagine what Wait, it was did like I have for her to, to lose two sons after she'd already lost two brothers. She spent a summer building houses in Kolkata, where she met my dad. Sanjay. Religion was another thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. I do have to go back, huh? I do have to read that. So this was all what. Whee! I can look at you from any side of the room. Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh when he thought he was alone? Like something funny was happening, but only he could see it. I think he saw things. I'm a baby now. Well, Des, I give it to you. I've, I've never played as a baby before. Bathtub's over, Gregory. It's time to... Don't leave your son in the bathtub unattended. Don't do it. But he probably drowns. Hello? I bet he goes into the, the, the drain, I'm calling it. Woohoo! I wonder what he saw. Whee! Gotta pop the little duckies that are floating in realistic bubbles. What his world was like. They reminded me so much of Cal. Lost in his imagination. Whatever it was he saw, it sure made him happy. I'm controlling the frog, guys. Nothing else, just the frog. Oh, I gotta go press the button on the top. I have to get on top of this. I almost paused it. I have to pull the plug. Whee! Oh, I see. I know how Give me that shit, goes. bitch. What I do, what I do, boy. But I worried about a baby being too happy. He's gonna drown. I heard about it. I can feel him slipping away. Sorry about that, Gregory. Mom! No way! Well, you did everything you could. Maybe if I hadn't called that night. I knew it. Damn it. Hold on, I don't want Gregory to be careful. Okay? 
I wish you could I knew it. Us about the world you saw. Turn it off! Turn it off, please! There's so much I don't understand. About Gregory. Hey, what? What the frog? About everything. I bet I can see him drowning. Maybe I can save him. Other side, he should be behind me, right? Fucking whale's fault, dude. But I know what happened was in your fault. I'm sure he's happy. And he'd want you to be happy too. I'm sure he's happy. Ed. Good luck, Kay. Love, Sam. Wait, they got divorced for this. Oh, their son died, and then they got divorced after it happened. That's dramatic. Wow, that sucks. That's, that's rough. That's rough. Wow. That'd be pretty rough. Yeah. That would suck. I can't imagine my mom ever writing poetry, and yet... A poem for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard, before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. That hit us in the heart. Let's be real, 95% of us got like punished before when we were children. Nowadays it doesn't happen because people cry about it, but it, it happened. Can I fly? Why is it? Oh, I gotta get the words. It's being true. Yeah. I never did. Well, you fucking should have dragged like a little shit, course, kid. But Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. I tried to talk him out of it, but though he'd never met her, we don't need a stepmom, were the words that I... I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> woohoo! Yeah, woohoo! There's some writing up. We're here? When the time for photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. here. But oh. Gus declined, and as a sign, held up his middle finger. Oh, and his dad. Fuck you, Dad! Fuck you! That'd be embarrassing. The wind picked up, and panic geese appeared and quickly went. But all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. Raining, should be flying a kite. The face change. Need words. I don't see them there. He's doing it. Sure. Where the fuck is the word? Oh, right here. Whoa, whoa! The rain came down in buckets then, but no one seemed afraid that nature might destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. Ah! Ah! The thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. 
But all my father said to this was make the music louder. We all have rough. Damn, I'm flying. I have to run it into the tent eventually. Oh, there it is. Oh. I still see them there. Their 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 character models aren't moving. Okay. I wish that I could truly say I thought about you on that day, out there on the beach alone. Just you, the wind, sea, and foam. But I didn't. Until we found you. Hmm? What happened? So Gus was the kid that didn't like his dad, she and never Gus about died him. flying a kite. Mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. <sighs> Gus hate the gut. Gus didn't like his father. So, he was flying a kite, and then Gus died because the tent flew up and hit him. Alright. Hey, I've already been up here, I think. Am I supposed to come back up here? Yeah. My mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Lewis was born a year later. When my dad died, I don't think Mom knew where else to go. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. The house had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. And for a while, Hot things were good. Homeschool. Almost normal. But it didn't last. The beginning of the end was Milton's 10th birthday when Edie gave him a castle. I'd have to go around. I'm not going to try the door. I know I got to go around. All doors are locked. I think Edie was happy to finally have another painter in the family. Where's the toad? That kid, yeah, he was picked on at school for show. Yikes, yeah, he was picked on. Those are some wonky ass teeth. Unlock, 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 unlock. Milton Finch in The Magic Paintbrush. Don't tell me I gotta restart. No! Shit. Sorry. I did it again. Wait, I think that, that picked up from where I left off. Drew a doorway. I bet he can walk through it now. disappeared so Milton just so Milton painted a doorway and just walked okay All right. mom spent months searching for my brother then she sealed the doors how long boys if, if you lost somebody how long would you search for him forever you can't search for you I mean really there's a time where you say no more like they're gone is gone Whatever Milton had found in the house, 
Mom didn't want it getting out. Forever? Never. Nobody I love. Mom definitely blamed Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room until Mom got him a job at the cannery. One of the kids lived to graduate? This is, a, this is a fucking room, boy. Got a bong? Oh. Lewis's room smelled very, very familiar. Oh. That part of him lived on. Ah, it was. It, wait, it actually is? Was I right? It, was I right? I think I was right, actually. A hookah? Oh, sorry. Well, it's a hookah, Kayla. Yo, sorry. I'm not a weed smoker. I don't know what all this... We take not whoa, it's a hookah, it's a bong. Who cares? Drugs are bad, fuck you. Sorry, I don't know the correct terminology. Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began in January. Shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Whoa! Newly sober, oh. I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. Oh, so drugs helped him. He kept working at the cannery. But he withdrew part of himself. In our sessions, I saw the same behavior. I bet he, I bet he His mind it. began to... Into what? Wonder. Oh. I asked him to describe it. I don't, I don't know if you guys know what I'm doing, but I'm actually cutting the fish's head while I'm controlling the maze. Just so you guys know. Yeah. He said he started small. Imagining a labyrinth. He'd feel his way about. Ooh, I bet he's gonna lose track of his. Wait, was this guy who cut off his hand? Then something moved. Bats. And toads. And things that have not names. He knew it was all in his head. He took it very seriously. I had hoped he'd find himself. This hand's gone. Yeah, this bitch is getting cut off 100%. But he found something more. I worried about it. I'm playing What's it called? The Dab Diablo? Diablo? I spoke with his boss. Like a sorcerer. But he said Lewis had become a model employee. Methodical, tireless, focused. Like a whole new Lewis. So I let him go on. Diablo? It's called Diablo. I oh, even encouraged it's, it's him. Taking more of his workspace. I bet he gets fully immersed into it. Like he loses the it sight of your life. very promising at first. He told me he'd made a new friend. <laughs> On the edge of a city he named Lewis Topia. He built the city up slowly, brick by brick. Then he made musicians.
find songs for them to play. He talked about starting a band. And he was always humming something. This guy's losing his fucking marbles. Every day his imagination grew stronger. No I, I've noticed that I've, I'm starting to cut less uh, fish. But his chopping was as reliable as ever. Then one day it struck him that all the cheering crowds, even the stones under his feet, were all in his imagination. So he could do whatever he wished. He held an election for mayor. And he won. Wow, he won an election. Wow. They begged him to stay, watch this, watch this. but his mind was already. Too slow, too slow. Too slow, too slow, too slow. Out of the way, excuse me, excuse me, get out of the way. It became a game for him. He'd conquer a city, then immediately push on. New Louisville. St. Louis. <laughs> Get it? St. Louis, but it's not L. Louis, his name's Lu <laughs> Lever. Good one, guys. Oh, my shipwreck. Minneapolis. <laughs> Until one day he forgot to go home from the cannery. Even as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Oh. In Lewisburg, he oh, heard right, right. of a of a of a of a uh, yeah, I'm not Kevin. Let's go right. Oh, yeah, because I'm not. If I was a girl, I'd Handsome played. queen. Yeah, not happening. Not ice. The queen was on her own quest for. Uh, uh, Sinister Serpents seems like it'd be like combat, so. I want an alpha girlfriend, dude. Sinister serpents. Whoa! Whoa! Look at those tentacles! Whoa! He followed the sound of her. Uh, usually, since this time, uh, played like harps. Silver harp. Cutting the fish's head is getting oh. I missed that no no Can I turn around? No, I bet that's important. I missed that. Oh no. Oh my god, my fish are stacking up too. His chase no. led him to a golden palace east of the sun of No! No! Even then, his logic remained sound. Oh well. Wait, I came in. Look, look, it, it's it, it was full screen. He knew the, game the world now. was all in his imagination. Fish are stacking up. Fish are stacking up. But he was so proud of having created it. In his own eyes, he'd become something greater than a king. This game looks oh. For someone who'd never known success in the real world, I think it was overwhelming. And then it struck him that the real Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of a golden palace. Uh. Mm. 
My imagination is as real as my body, he told me. It was hard to argue with him. Oh, my hand's gone. Here we go. Wait, this looks like work. No, I'm still in my clothes. Oh, that's how he sees himself, but this is how it really is. He began to forget the world we know. I think it pained him to remember Lewis, the cannery worker. Oh, is this me? began to despise the man with a royal contempt. That's me. What's doing is lost. I still thought I could save him. Even after he said he was being crowned king over all the lands of wonder. The palace would be packed with his companions. Thank you. Hey, hey, thank you. Thank you. God. Yeah. Uh, hello. Hello. Hey. Thank Including you. Thank you. Wise Calico would insisted on advising him. Is that a cat? Uh... Molly. Wait, wasn't it that girl? Monster? His queen waited, holding his crown. I bet this queen probably turns, in, turns in, into a monster. Watch, I'm calling it right now. Watch. There was only one thing left to do. I'm calling it, I'm calling it. Sick, I guess. Thanks. Oh, uh, kill himself so he can stay here forever. And the rest I think you know. Mrs. Finch, your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. So he killed him, so he went crazy. Wanted to live in his own imagination, so he killed himself so that he could live there. He probably cut his head off on the fish thing. My brother was really cool. Damn. I wish you could have met him. So he cut his head off on the fish thing. Damn. He had a nice ass setup, though, boy. Look at this shit. It was before his time. What kind of keyboard is this? Uh, appears to be uh, Aircraft 817. That's good. No mouse pad dance game? Fucking casual? No mouse pad! Lewis and I spent a lot of time playing games together, but he was surprisingly bad at them. He died a lot. Died a lot IRL too. Boom. Actually, matter of fact, one second. Uh, speaking of mouse pads, you could have actually went to lowtime.com and alpha and purchased a nice mouse pad. There's two different kinds. There's the long keyboard mouse pad and there's just a big old square mouse pad. Get it now while it's hot, boys. On the way back from Lewis's funeral, my mom told me to start packing. She waited until the day before we left to tell Edie. I'm not sure if she wanted to make it easier or harder. I wish we'd stayed. But I understand why we left. What happened that night had been coming for a long time. Maybe it should have come sooner. The burger. But it had to end one way or another. Who died? Edith? Edith. All that's left now is to tell you about that last night. Wait, is this me? This is me. This is how I die. Yeah, get cozy. Get 
cozy. Writing her own story. That whole last day, Edie just watched us pack and didn't say a word. Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, Poison To our final night together. And all our final nights apart. Grandma, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very Edith, specific. I left a present for you in the hallway. A bomb. Why don't you go open it? The grown-ups have to argue now. I'm sorry, you're right. We're all leaving tomorrow. Let's just enjoy our last... I'm not leaving. Edith, you're excused. So that's me. Their parents got into a dispute. Or, Grandma and Mom. The power had been shut off that morning, but Edie always had plenty of candles. When my mom sailed the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance. Or that Edie had a key to it. To the random in the chat who just said, boys, sh should I get pizza or wings tonight? Uh, I would, I'd probably go right now. Pizza, dude. Wings? Eh. I, I don't like them if they have bones in them. They're way too messy. Yeah, pizza. Pepperoni. The thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. The curse we're talking about. The fall of them. Edith has a right to know these stories. My children are dead because of your stories. I think it's best if Edith and I leave tonight. Wait, the grandma could have killed them all. We'll have the nursing home send a van for you in the morning. Okay. Oh, she's not gonna go to a nursing home. There's no way. There's no way. Shit. Was this the grandma's plan? Come on! Oh, yeah, hold it. Dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you, but there's only time for one. This is about what happened on the night you were born. That night, the tide went way, way out. It was the first and last time I ever saw the old house aground. There'd been an earthquake out in the middle of the ocean. They called it the lowest tide in a thousand years. God, it smelled awful. You know, I've seen that house every day of my life. Maybe those are the I never thought I'd go back to it. When the fog rolled in, I lost my way. You can just go straight? I mean, you forgot to walk or something? I got turned around. She got... For a while, I wandered. I don't want to make a wrong prediction. I started seeing things. Things I'd forgotten had ever existed. Oh, is the house? But when I saw them, they felt like old friends. That night, a lot of things came back to me. Or maybe oh, she's I at the house. came back to them. There's a ring on her left. Oh, she has those girls that wear rings. Things I can't explain, but that I need you to try and... Edith, what are you doing in here? It's mine. Edith! 
Mom, you're gonna rip it. Let go. Let go, Mom. Get off, Mom. Let go. I didn't scream, but Mom dragged me to the car. Let me out now. The next morning, the van came to pick her up, but she was already gone. Of course. After that, we moved around a lot. Put your hand in the window. Danger. We both tried to make the best of it. Put your hand in the vehicle. Edie! Put your hand in the car! Get your hand in the car! Oh, I'm moving it. Whee! A few years went by. My mom didn't like to talk about it. But she started getting sick a lot. <coughs> the rest happened pretty quickly. She got better for a while. And then she didn't. And then I was alone. Last finch left alive. Until I found out about you. I'm still not sure what to tell you about all this. If we lived forever, maybe we'd have time to understand things. But as it is, I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes. And appreciate how strange and brief all of this is. Oh, we can move. This journal was supposed to be for you. Wait, am I? Am I cut? This is a vagina. I'm almost positive. But now I hope you'll never see it. I'm. I'm the child coming I out. I just want to meet you and tell you all these stories it's myself. Like blood cells, actually. You know, like like I'm in a vein. But I guess if you're reading this now. I am. Things didn't work out that it is way. Vain. I was right, wasn't I? Watch. This is where your story begins. I'm sorry I won't be there to see it. It's a lot to ask, but I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. I want you to be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. Good luck. Huh? Oh, I was right. She did that d during birth. Wait, what happened? Wait, is the game over? Is that the game? She died during childbirth. I, I, so I was right. I caught it at the beginning. She died during the childbirth and... Wait, so where does the story go from here now? Wow, that was... Okay. Yo, devs, quick game review. Devs, uh, there... You... What? What were you thinking at the start of the game? You gave us no information. At the end of the game, you just end it like that without any kind of satisfaction? I, I do not feel satisfied right now after beating this game. I don't. And here you are showing me pictures of your family, what you guys look like while you're younger, trying to make me feel some type of... I don't care. I did not pay to feel good about my- I paid for a fucking game to play, dude. And I'm not satisfied with your product, and it will be refunded on Steam. No ifs, ands, or buts. 2 out of 10, do not recommend. Whew. That was a rough one. That was a fucking rough one, boys. Good night. How long is- is, is this the end of the game? Is there some kind of, like, catch scene? Like, ending scene after the credits? Does anybody know? Yay or nay, or can I just skip it? Oh, look, jo Joanna, we don't care what you look like. I, I just unlocked your achievement, actually. Yeah. 
ありがとうございます。Yes, I gotta use the e restroom. I don't know how long it's gonna take. There, is there nothing at all after the ending? Okay, uh. Ooh, there's a. The replay story option is now available. Select either to play from the beginning. <laughs> Guys, I have to, uh. Uh, use the restroom. I told you. Beginning of stream. Yeah, I'll be right back. It'll. Honestly, right now, I only got to go take a piss, but I'll be right back.